Hello everyone this is Tuba Mirza and welcome to Recoding All the code used inside this video are mentioned inside the description box So if you like the work we are doing and if you're learning something from our videos please do subscribe to our channel and share it with your group because your subscription will make this type of video happen in the future So without any further ado let's get started In this video we are going to learn about making dark and light mode theme inside your Swift UI app Our app will consist of a toggle button on the navigation bar. While tapping on the navigation button, it will switch the theme of the app. We also added list along with navigation link to show how consistent our design is. And also added sheet to open overlay view. So let's get started. First, we are going to set our emulator to iPhone device. Then inside content view body add navigation view. Inside it create list which iterates its value from 0 to 15. Then attach id to self. Then for each item inside the list We are going to show a text along with its number. We wrap the list inside B stack. Then add navigation title by adding navigation title modifier and the text inside it. Now create a button to open the sheet. Create a button view. Add action and label as parameter. Inside label add label view and add text and images. Then add button style as bordered. And add button tint as mint color. Create new state as a sheet and initial value as false. Then below the V stack add sheet modifier. Inside it presented parameter as the state as binding using dollar sign and state name as a sheet. Then add the closure and add a text inside it named as sheet. Then inside button action we set to toggle our is sheet state. Now add toolbar modifier below the V stack. Then add the toolbar item view inside it at placement parameter to set on trailing side of the nav bar. Then inside it create a button. For storing a theme toggle value, we are going to use app storage property wrapper so that when we close our app, it will save value inside the app. so that a theme change will be remember for creating add app storage property wrapper then add variable you want to store for the data then add it as variable is dark which has initial value as false then inside a button we are going to show button as per r is dark variable As if the dark mode is true, we show light bulb icon as fill and if not, we only show light bulb.
Here inside the preview, we can see that our app is working. Now for changing the theme for the view, we add the environment modifier inside it. We are going to need color scheme variable. Then for its value, we check if our is dark is true or false and if we set as according to it either light or dark. Here we need to add the environment modifier below the navigation view now we stack. So we can see that a dark mode is working fine. But adding environment inside the sheet doesn't change the color of view background. To change it, we can also use preferred color modifier and set the color according to that. So we can see our app is showing dark and light color according to our need. Now add navigation list inside the list by adding navigation link view and add destination as text along with the item number. For the label we simply show the item text. So here we can see that dark mode and light mode colors are consistent around the whole UI of the app. And yes, let us know what you liked or disliked about this video in the comment section. Please do like and subscribe to our channel. And yes, do not forget to suggest some more topics. For now, I'll be signing off. We'll definitely see you all in the next video.